I want to make a quick clarification based on the last video. In the last video, we compared fractions. For example, we cared, compared four sevenths to three sevenths. And we saw clearly four sevenths is a larger fraction of the whole than three sevenths was. But you might say, hey, but what if, what if my whole was bigger? What if I took three sevenths of this big thing here? Then three sevenths would look like this. So it would be one, one, two, three sevenths. And so this 3 7 this looks like I have filled in more than I would have over here for the, three, for the 4 7 So doesn't it matter which hole you're taking the fraction of? And the answer is yes, it does matter. And you, when you compare fractions, you assume that you're taking fractions of the same whole. So you can only make this comparison right over here. So it has to be, let me make this very clear, it has to be the same it has to be the same the same hole that you're making the comparison. You can't compare 4 7 of a mouse to 3 7 of an elephant. Those are two different things. You cannot make that comparison. You could compare 4 7 of a mouse to 3 7 of that same mouse or a mouse the same size. Then you could make the same comparison. When we talk about fractions as just pure numbers, then we're then we automatically go to the number line. The whole that we talk about when we're on the number line is the section of our number line between 0 and 1. So that makes it, so if this is 0 and then this is 1 here, when we talk about fractions as just pure numbers, we're not saying 4 7 of a mouse or 4 7 of an elephant, we're just talking about a number on the number line. And so we would split this into 7 Let me see if I could do that. Gee, let me draw. So that's 1 7 2 7 3 7 4, 5, 6, and that's 7 sevenths right over there, or 1. So this is 7 sevenths or 1. And this right over here is 1 seventh, 2 sevenths, 3 sevenths, 4 sevenths, 5 sevenths, whoops, 5 sevenths, and 6 sevenths. And so when you look at the number line here, it's clear that 3 sevenths, which is 3 jumps from 0, 3 jumps of a seventh each, 1, 2, 3. 3 sevenths puts you right there, while 4 sevenths is a larger number. It's to the right of 3 sevenths. You have to make four jumps. One, two, three, four. Four jumps of a seventh to get right over there. So you can make this comparison as long as you're doing it. You're looking at the fraction of the same whole. Here, the same whole is the region of our number line between 0 and 1. In the previous video, the same hole was this yellow bar. You can't compare 4 sevenths of this yellow bar to 3 sevenths of this much larger blue bar.